Hi everyone, uh, Cinexsoft here. So I've been using Xiaomi Mi Band 2 for now two weeks. So I get a good uh, grasp of what it can do and what it cannot do. Uh, okay, first of all, let's go through the battery life since it's an important aspect. Uh, the company promises uh, 20, 20 days and I got 14 days. Uh, that's, that's not too bad even with uh, notifications and uh, one day, the 12th day, I did notice a sharp drop between 39% to 19% 39% in the morning and 19% in the evening so I'm not sure what happened there so let's check the option in the display this is the time you press again the step count, Estim distance, estimated calorie, this is the heartbeat, heart rate monitor, you have some LEDs working behind. And since I'm not wearing it, it should not give a value. So let's wait. Okay, it has vibrated and you can see across that means error message so let me let me wear it okay and do the measurement again okay you wait a few seconds and then you get a measurement so you you will uh, use one app with the system called Mifit installed from from Google Play so here you can see the status for the day, number of stay, steps, how I slept last night, and you have a separation between deep sleep and light sleep. So this looks okay. Some statistics. Here you have also the heartbeat and the latest measurements I've done. So the heartbeat has many shortcomings, let's say. First, I, it can only do one shot measurement. And second, you can also start it from the phone. Oh, sorry, yeah. <laughs> okay, and here you see, don't move. And I, actually they are very serious about this. Because if I walk, if I run, I cannot check. It will fail. And uh, if you are doing exercise, you, you already have to stop to take measurement. And yeah, and now 60 is a little low, I think. So the accuracy is not always good. So. Okay, the art rate monitor is completely useless. However, uh, for the step count, this is this is working quite well. Here we you will go to the summary for the day. And uh, in the play section, you can configure incoming calls. It will vibrate and show uh, a small icon. So let's have a demo of this. This is the phone, and I'm going to call myself.
Okay, now it's vibrating and showing this icon for a short time and keep vibrating during its during the call. And then you have to pick up your phone to answer the call if you want. Okay. So this one uh, works well for me. And the alarm, it's also a silent alarm. You can set three alarms and it will vibrate. I think it will vibrate um, four times, like three vibration for four times and after snooze and 10 minutes later start again if you have not waken up. It also supports app notifications and uh, for testing I selected Messenger on Skype and it's working very well. Uh, you will get uh, app icon, app, yeah, app text on your uh, Xiaomi Mi Band 2 as well as some vibration and is the, the program you can use any of the, app, of the install apps on your phone. Okay, and sit alert. Uh, it's just in case you stay on your chair too long. But uh, yes, it's only 60 minutes, 90 minutes, and 120 minutes. So it works, but it's not that useful. Okay, and you can have some more configuration here. Incoming SMS did not work for me. I have no idea why. There is a screen unlock function, uh, but you need Android 5.0, and my phone is Android 4.4. .4. And you also have a, a third party access, but I have not tried. And here you can check, finally, you can check your profile with some statistics, battery levels, set your goal. And a few other settings. Okay, so that's all there is to say about this. Almost. Uh, because it's also said to be uh, IP67. But uh, since yesterday, I get a little humidity inside. So it's not so good and I have just washed my hands and taken showers. I haven't gone swimming or taking a bath or anything like this. Also, uh, the button here is not an actual button. So if you wear gloves, if you wear thick gloves, it will not work. You need to wear some special gloves. It's a, it's a capacitive touch area. Okay. So in conclusion, good battery life. Activity tracking in terms of number of steps is working very well. Uh, but unfortunately the heart rate monitor is, I think is completely useless. And the OLED screen is not so bright, so it's difficult to look in, in the sunshine. And apart from that, this it's all good. Alright, thanks for watching. Bye-bye.